When families are unable to pay for needed services for their children, or if insurance denies coverage, these families are forced to make a terrible choice. They either let their child go untreated, or they're forced to give up their parental rights to the state in order to access the services their child needs. We ran out of um, benefits for my daughter when she uh, got into a psychiatric crisis. Uh, the only treatment left at that time was to uh, take her to the emergency room where, whereby they'd give her Thorazine, knock her out, send her home. Uh, and uh, we realized that she really did need the treatment and we were told the only option to get payment for it was custody relinquishment. Uh, it feels terrible. Uh, you feel that you're having to give up on your child when really all you're trying to do is, is help your child. It's very hard to explain to a 14-year-old girl why you had to do what you had to do uh, when everybody else is making decisions on her behalf. And uh, it, it's just very devastating for, for parents. This was 10 years ago for us, and it is still going on today. Uh, there's many states that have laws banishing this practice, but Nebraska fails to, to see the negative impact that this has on families who are very vulnerable and already hurting and suffering. The solution is to work with families. Uh, it, don't ostracize them, don't blame and shame. I have a child with a mental illness. I'm not a bad parent, she's not a bad person. The solution is to work with us and work with the whole family. But then when necessary, if they need out-of-home solutions, then try and make it very short-term, very focused, so that the kids and families can always stay together.